Cancer 2015. So uh, let's see what's going to happen with Cancer. <clears throat> It seems like for uh, some of you, a uh, child is coming this year. Uh, this is what you're being looking for, to create a child. That can be very much possible this year. Or if you are one of those cancers who actually had a problem with a child, like maybe communication or some difficulties or some worries related to a child, that's going to be... <clears throat> resolve this year there are some cancers out there who are going to feel more uh, creative they're not going to have that feeling of getting stuck like somehow they felt like if you are a writer maybe you felt like you don't have those creative juices anymore you're missing your inspiration like you can't create anymore if you are in communication fields media advertising or a writer a teacher <clears throat> So um, you feel like you can't create or write or be more <clears throat> productive in that field. It seems like those blockages are going to be removing and everything or your creative ideas are going to come more uh, easy uh, this year. There's some major dramatic sudden changes this uh, year uh, that could be related to uh, your health. Maybe you have to deal with some uh, health issues that you thought you dealt with in the past. Maybe you have a chronic condition that might come back. Or maybe you have a new health condition. Nothing major, nothing to be worried. But something that you're going to have to work on in order for your health to get better maybe you're going to have to improve your fitness level uh your nutrition <clears throat> so you have to work with a health professional in order for you to take care of this problem and if it is a chronic condition this is going to be the last of it it's, um, or even if it comes back in the future it's not going to be as uh, difficult or to this uh, degree so that's going to be dealt with uh, successfully. There are some of you who are going to see some uh, internal changes like uh, this death of your ideas that maybe you were focusing more on very... Uh, superficial stuff like just appearance or something that is important now there's this internal change in you where you feel like you have to deal with much more uh, meaningful uh, deeper uh, things because you're going to feel more creative this year for some of you who are in different communication fields arts media advertising writing teacher public speaking because you're going to feel more creative, then you're going to advance in your career. You're going to communicate better with others. As a result, you're going to... Um uh, have you're gonna be making more money at your job? You're gonna have a raise, maybe get better clients, or maybe sell more if you're selling a service or a product, and you're gonna have more money coming through. So uh, <clears throat> this way, you're gonna be able to afford something that you always wanted to get. Like I see you getting the keys to a car, maybe that you wanted to have, or a house that you wanted to uh, uh, buy. <clears throat> For some of you, it seems like uh, <clears throat> you will be signing some documents. You're going to have to deal with an authority figure, maybe a government issue. You're going to have like, it seems like you're face to face with this person repre representing authority, like a boss or a government. You're resolving some issues, you're discussing about something, it's like you're making a deal, and then you sign some papers or a contract that would give you the keys or the opportunity to travel internationally. So you're going to go visit another country this year. Or maybe you're getting a visa if this is what you want. It can be like a tourist visa or maybe travel for work. So this is very much possible uh, this year. But uh, your status, your in the world, in your society, is going to change. That that means that 
Your status within a business partnership might change. Uh, maybe your marital status might change, like maybe you're single and get married, or maybe you're married and suddenly you receive that sad news and um, you're going to receive those divorce papers or separation. Uh, maybe you're going to get uh, sad news, this is going to happen around the third month of the year or the fourth so around March or April when maybe you don't belong to a social club anymore so there are going to be some endings here with an older uh, or the circles of friends that you have right now but new beginnings are also possible so if this is the case where your friendship status is going to change then you're going to have uh, then more friends are coming your way, you're going to get to know, to know a whole new circus of friends. So, uh, <clears throat> there are some uh, other changes in here. You're going to improve your communication with someone who lives close to you or someone that you communicate or see on a daily basis. Maybe you had a problem with a family member or a sibling or a difficult neighbor or a difficult boss or a difficult co-worker that really he doesn't like you, you don't like them, you have very difficulties getting along. But this can suddenly change, you're going to see improvements. In your communication and you're gonna get um, along for some of you this ch sudden change this is, that is coming uh, related to your status can also mean that maybe you're gonna get a uh, change in your profession or in your workplace or even in your uh, address so you're gonna have very sudden changes coming through some difficulties here here and there related to your health, your status, your marriage or relationship problems. But as I said, they're gonna you're gonna be able to overcome all of them and you're gonna get stronger and wiser and more mature as a result of it.